Salmon go through six different stages in life cycle. Egg, alvin, fry, smolt, adult, and spawner. They start off as an egg, tiny and fragile. These embryos are usually around 6 to 9 millimeters in diameter. The little fellows can have around 500 to 1,000 siblings in one red. If an egg is fertilized, it begins to develop. Salmon eggs prefer temperatures from 5 to 9 degrees Celsius. If the water temperature rises above 20 degrees Celsius, the little eggs start to die. When the eggs hatch, they become elephant. Every elephant has a yolk sac attached to the bottom of their bellies. The sac acts as a food supply and helps the small elephant grow. Elephant live in dark areas to hide from predators. Once their sac runs out of food, they become fry and must find their own. Fry have vertical markings called par marks and feed off plankton and insects. As the fry grow older, they turn into smolts. When ready, the smolts travel downstream until they reach the estuary. An estuary is where the river meets the ocean. Estuaries contain brackish water, which is salt water mixed with fresh water. The salmon stay here to adapt to the saltiness of the ocean. Here in the estuary, the salmon must watch out for pollution, kingfisher, loon, herring, and older salmon. <coughs> it is here that the smolts become adults. Once ready, they will travel into the vast ocean. Now the grown salmon must watch out for whales, seals, humans, more pollution, and much more. The salmon scavenge for food for up to around seven years until it is ready to spawn. Most salmon return back to the river it was born in. Male salmon turn green and red, while females turn brown. Males also grow large teeth and a hooked nose. Now the salmon must make one last journey before they die, traveling upstream. They must fight furious waterfalls and currents while trying to avoid bears, eagles, otters, minks, and humans. Once at the spawning grounds, the males fight for the best places to spawn. The females dig a nest in the gravel called the red, while the male sits there watching. Once the female is done, the male comes and he releases his milk while the female releases her eggs. When they are done, the female buries the eggs. The tired salmon soon die, the corpse slowly rots away, and the cycle starts again.